Hello YouTubers, this is Madam Iris with my very first vlog. Yes, my very first. I have spoken with a few other players of RuneScape in their other videos. Um, I can't really remember their names off the top of my head. I want to say one was Dan RS and the other one was It's Jet. I'm not sure. Um, but <clears throat> really good players there. Uh, I wanted to point out that I am an adult player, first of all. I've been a rest of this game for seven years, and I'm getting pretty close to being a max player. Um, I went this weekend for the, um, yeah, the winter weekend double mini games and D and D. Uh, as you can see here, I'm just waiting it out in the waiting room. Oh, there we go, right into the game at Castle Wars. Uh, I did Castle Wars, Soul Wars, and Pest Control. I didn't get into any of the other D&Ds. I have 99s in most of them, except for the big Chachampa mini game that they have there. Um, I've got tons of tickets that I have to get those blown right out so I can have some more room in my bank. Um, <clears throat> yeah, there's, excuse me, I... I think I'm coming down with a cold or something. Gotta love this lovely winter weather that's coming in. <laughs> so, um, yeah, uh, I've just kind of played around, you know, trying to see, you know, all these new controls. I really haven't been out doing anything in combat since EOC blew through. Um, <clears throat> it's all different for me. I have nothing else to really, you know, increase level or anything with combat except for my range. Um, <clears throat> other than that, everything else is 99 for combat skills. Um, but, yeah, I had a little bit of fun here and there, and then <clears throat> went to Soul Wars. I could barely move. I mean, you'll see some some clips in here that I could hardly move at all. Um, Pest control, that was so fast. The boats were glitched. Uh, people were screaming at everybody to get out of the boats, out of the vets at least. Nobody was wanting to go to the mediums or the beginners or whatever. Um, yeah, so I had pretty, pretty much good fun and everything, except for I really screwed up when it came to pest control. I went to turn in 139 uh, tickets there and whatever they call them there. And I blew them on prayer. I wasn't even paying attention. And I just put it all on prayer. And I'm like, screw this. I'm leaving. Um, but, hey, that's what I get for not paying attention, huh? So, yeah. Um, now that this weekend is over, we have the next upcoming update this week of the player-owned ports. What are your guys' input, thoughts, and comments about this? You know, I... I think it'd be pretty cool, interesting, and everything else. I mean, it, it's real time. That's the whole thing. You know, it's kind of like, um, oh, miscellania. You know, the whole kingdom up there. Um, I don't really use it that much. I should, but, I mean, I, like, use it once or twice a month. <laughs> I'm just, like, blowing through my money and everything, so I kind of go up there and pull out my max money up there. I put like 7.5 mil up there or whatever the max is. And I just leave it there for a week and then I end up going and pulling it out. Um, <laughs> so yeah, I mean, it's, it's really interesting. I mean, you get resources, it's time management and everything. And, you know, you get to do everything to it, you know, do your crew. I mean, I guess you get to name your boat or something, and on top of that, you know, a lot of a lot of the resources on there, I mean, you know, just to get started alone, it's like 90 in, what, fishing, prayer herb lore, rune crafting, thieving, and slayer, you've got to have 90 in at least one of these, so <clears throat> that's quite a, quite a high requirement there. Which isn't bad. I mean, it's something for, you know, the high levels. You got more content out there for lower levels than anything, and a lot of us high levels are kind of left out there. Um, but they did say something about needing 90 RC for, um, oh gosh, what was it? Making the mage armor? And then you had to have 90 smithing to make the other armor? So I guess, you know, there's, there's quite a bit out there, you know, to kind of look forward to, I guess. So, I guess we'll see. You know, I'm, I'm pretty sure I'll kind of make another little uh, 
video about that. You know, I'm I'm kind of happy about getting into doing all this YouTube stuff. It's it's quite interesting. I guess it really puts a person out there <laughs> on the spot. Um, another thing I want to talk about is the upcoming Christmas update. Is it me, or are we going to be housing the stray dogs? I, I, I'm not quite following that. I, <laughs> I, I saw that on their video, and I'm like, okay, sure. I mean, if, if that's what, you know, this is all going to be about, you know, I don't know. I mean, I don't really know what the rewards are going to be or anything. I don't, I'm not sure anybody knows really yet. Um... But I hope it's better than what the past events have been. Uh, not too many people have been happy with the past few uh, holiday events. It, they just kind of, you know, have been dwindling a lot. They really haven't been, you know, very exciting. Um, but, hey, you know, I guess, I guess they're trying their best. You know, I mean... They can only do so much at a time. <laughs> so, um, hmm, I'm not sure what else to talk about. <laughs> I guess if you have any comments, questions, or whatever to throw out there, go right ahead. I am open to everything. Um, other than that, thank you for taking your time to listen to me babble on, and we'll see you next time. See ya!